Hello everyone. Today in this address we are going to find the member forces in the members BC, BE and in FE. To find all three of them we can make a section like this because this section cuts all the three members. In the points A and G no need to find the reactions because we are going to take the right side portion and find the member forces. We can easily find FBC by taking moment about E because when we take moment about E except FBC we should not consider any of them. We should not consider FBE, FEF, this 35 and this 35. So there is only one force remaining that is FBC. If there is only one force that will be 0. So FBC will be 0. To find the FEF we can take moment about to B. When we take moment about to B we should not consider FBC. Anyway, it is already zero. We should not consider FBE. The remaining forces are FEF 35 and this 35. This 35 is acting in the clockwise direction so that it will be positive and the distance is 3. This 35 is acting in the anti-clockwise direction so that it will be negative and the distance is 3. FEF is acting in the clockwise direction so that it will be positive and the distance is 3. We can eliminate these two. Finally for FEF we will get 0. Now let us apply the rule sigma v is equal to 0 and find FBE. 35 is acting downwards so that it will be negative. FBE is inclined we have to resolve it in the vertical direction. To resolve it in the vertical direction, we need this angle. Length of EC is 3 meter. Length of BC is also 3 meter. In this case, this angle should be 45 degree. FBE is acting upwards so that it will be positive and we have to multiply with the cos 45. For FBE, we will get a positive value that means it is tensile.